probably hard on this way, but we get bon lots of bonuses. Oh yeah, by the way, we got the scroll of any fuss after the last quest, so we can continue with that. Okay, sword of crush. I mean, we hold on to some of these for sentimental value, but ooh, I got a scepter. And a really good one at that. That's a good scepter. And a decent buckler, dang. Well, the magic of upgrading. So, we will be in the expansion pack from now on. And I may go past Act 2, but I'm doing a walkthrough with Kota Zoom Spider, so that possibility is very bleak. But anyway, let's head on over. Let's check our settings. I feel kind of quiet. And... Oh, that's why. Adapt this to half. Move the music up here. There, that fixed the problem. When the game updates, it jacks up your settings. I don't get it at all. Alright, so we got the scroll of the first. Now we talk to... Kara. Oh, very good. I have translated the runes on this scroll. You must find the cairn stones and touch them in the order that I have written. Great, then, Akara. Sorry, guys, about that. So our quest log has been updated. Now we go. Now we go to the cairn stones and save Deckard. But Charcy will be selling us new gear what now. What can I do for you? Which is awesome. Where are some bucklers? Nah, nothing yet. But that is some good stuff. But my buckler is really good for this point in the game. Also, they added bla wrist blades. If you haven't se if you've seen them in Assassin's Creed, well, if you get the pat, if you get the Lord of Destruction expansion, expand the character. Guess what? You can use assassins, and assassins use those. Yay! All right, now we got to find the Karen stones. I'm not sure where they are. Cliff log. Stony field. Gold plains. It's mapped out somewhere on my map. I think that's where... <laughs> yeah, it's not great. There's nothing better than it. I don't get why the game gave me it, but... Thank you, game. You gave me a really awesome scepter. Mm -hmm -hmm. Making Paladin even more better than they already were. Ha <laughs> No, I'm not even on that level so I could go slower, so... Yeah. I'm not bad or I just need to find a new option. New Sean. No trouble. I feel like my life got a boost as well, so thank you, Update. But the game isn't over to him by any means. My dad was trying out Act 5 the other day of this Barbarian. As you can see, he's now called Champion. And, uh, <laughs> let's just say that didn't end up so well. So well. I'm trying to find as few as good as possible. Even though those Dark Hunters do give me some pretty decent experience. I need to get the Sony feel and start and get to Tristram. This was before they had new Tristram, so yeah, I just know that. Yeah, you guys are gonna take money skill. Cost much to kill him, and you have to use a potion. Plus, I got more potions. But I've never really explored this place that much, so I'm looking for two things: for the waypoint and the Karen stones. Oops! I wanted holy bolt. Okay. feels a lot, a little stronger. Mm -hmm. Show 
coming. Okay, I think that's right. Come on, guys. Every two gives you a millimeter of experience, so use it whenever you can, because it does add up. I was a fourth level, and I'm already halfway there, so they do, they are useful, I will say that. Oh well. Oh, this is where it comes from. There you go. Don't worry about those things spawning in. Haha, <laughs> I love volleyball. Okay, Karen Stones. I feel like you guys may not find it. I eventually found a waypoint in the dark wood. But, for some reason I don't think that recorded, so... Sorry about that. But anyway, yeah, I found the waypoint. Ooh, and I found this waypoint. Lucky me. So, yeah, now we have all the waypoints up till now. But there are more to come. There are really more to come. But, we need to find the Karen Stones. I like to X off any area it could be, so that's why I complete this area of the map. Just to confirm that it's not here, or it is. So I'm gonna go straight through. Up in there. Of course, I'm going to a different area. <laughs> and then we want my stamina recharge. Ah, maybe not. Take that. Mine's not the best skill, but I wish I had it earlier on my character. I mean, right as it is now, I need charge and and smite. And with all those two skills, I can't get holy shield. So I'm kind of bummed. But I'll just pour two levels into it, and then I'll have the fist feather, and then one level for it, I'll have the holy shield. Which I intend to max out, by the way. That's a, that's a really good move. I maxed out, I checked my guidebook. 220 seconds. That, that's a lot of time to use Holy Shield. Not to mention with the shield I have, it'll bring my def my chance of block to 95%. That's insane. But, uh, off topic, on this character, Oh, not that much, but if you guys see some videos where I seemingly am talking to myself, that's because I've, I'm talking to someone, but they just wouldn't show up, and I checked my call, and it said when any other sources get there, reduce the sound by 80%. I took that off, and now it, there shouldn't be any issues. Ooh, the Karen Stones. Okay, here we go. Yes. And Holy bold sucker. Okay. Yeah, you boys. These crap. Okay. I don't really order the current thing to just be activated. <laughs> take that. Ooh. I've been getting more and more of those drops a day. Ooh. Yes. Mmm. Not as good as my other one. Mm, way no 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 no. Not way not as good actually. Oh, I see. And head in there and fight some baddies. Quest log has been updated. Find and rescue Decker Kane. Here we go. 
This place is in a What deep. a tragic end to Tristram. Help! Deckard. Deckard Kane, leave quickly. point new possibilities 12 and level 9 you're gonna want to get that zeal move it's really successful what the I got prayer well I can try it whoa the aura slowly regenerates you and your party's health that's not bad now that's a rare case of a moment of an aura I can use I can switch from my might while we're low on health. Kind of heal me a little bit and then switch back to might. Phantasm. I can look into that. That's actually possible. But not now. Alright. Zeal is the move you wanna get. Hmm. How many points do I have in this? 80 damage. Level 5. It's really wanted where I wanted to cap, but well, I'm in. I like Holy Bolt. With that, don't kill it. It look, it would have killed any of those guys in three hits now. But I'm, gonna, but I'm really gonna start pouring pour, pouring points into Zeal when I get it. The reason I do this is because I want to know my base stats when I upgrade. Apparently, he doesn't want to show me my base stats. Uh, shield, you. Oh, not you. Scepter? No. Uh, I know that Gloves is doing it. Ooh, amulet. I'm gonna have to throw this down for a second. I'm gonna equip my Gloves. Stats. It's increasing my mana score. Energy, energy. Ooh. Oh, I'm gonna re-equip all of it. Dang! Boots too? Mm -hmm. Increases my mirror, I wanna know how much base. Dang it! Of course. I'll, get, I'll drop this, but I'm gonna pick it back up. Please let that be it. Thank you. Alright, 35 vitality, 35 strength, 30. I like it at least having 5 points over, so... Yeah, I'll spend 5 into this. I like you being nice and balanced there. I like these two being equal, dexterity only being 5 points behind, and this being a little bit more. 10 points, ideally. Alright, so now I put my gear again. And it's gonna give me a boost. Alright, now I need to pick up my gold cap and the colted armor I picked up. Nice. I already got all my gear back. So, unless I wanted to fight some baddies, I get to head back right now. They did give me experience rather fast. Yeah, this is the idea of maybe using it for that. Look at that experience. It was mainly because of that one dude, but still, it's crazy experience. What's this? Whoa! That's one of the new shields. Cool. I didn't expect to find that. I'm definitely gonna tr try to see if that's good, because that's my that's a first actually. Well, all right, this may have supposed to have been a base data, 
but this is, this is going to be a Lord of Destruction run through, so don't get confused. I've added the expansion halfway through Act 1, remember that. But I'm going to leave and head to the waypoint. Those guys were kind of hard, both holy bolt. I didn't have as many challenges to face. Impossible. This is why I prefer the Paladin over the Barbarian. He's... He's... Press... 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 I don't know the word, but... His right, right away... A, a, array of skills are just unbound. The Barbarian skills are good, but they're basically class, classed into two... Three categories. Single, single interesting stat hits, two weapon hits, and leaps. The war cries and combat masteries are cool, but it's just not my thing. Deckard. As a token of my gratitude, I will identify items for you at no charge. Regrettably, I could do nothing to prevent the disaster which devastated Tristram. It would appear that our greatest fears have come to pass. Diablo, the Lord of Terror, has once again been set loose upon the world. As you know, some time ago Diablo was slain beneath Tristram, and when our hero emerged triumphant from the labyrinth beneath town, we held a grand celebration that lasted several days. Yet, as the weeks passed, our hero became increasingly aloof. He kept his distance from the rest of the townsfolk and seemed to lapse into a dark, brooding depression. I thought that perhaps his ordeal had been so disturbing that he simply could not put it out of his mind. The hero seemed more tormented every passing day. I remember he awoke many times, screaming in the night, always something about the East. One day, he simply left, and shortly thereafter, Tristram was attacked by legions of foul demons. Many were slain, and the demons left me to die in that cursed cage. I believe now that Tristram's hero was that dark wanderer who passed this way before the monastery fell. I fear even worse, my friend. I fear that Diablo has taken possession of the hero who sought to slay him. If true, Diablo will become more powerful than ever before. You must stop him, or all will be lost. Wow. So, I think I understand a little bit more about the story thanks to Deckard. Thanks, dude. Okay, let's check out the shield. Nine. Change of luck 40%, my damage increased 2 to 6. It's more than that. All of the resistances. Repair wonder ability. Oh, dang. Oh, goodness. That is interesting. Huh. Just because it's got a little lower defense, I think it's worth it. I mean, that's, so, that's crazy. I, I don't even have to repair it. Smoke damage. I think they only decreased a little. Ooh. Just in case I want it back. This is what I like about sets. Oh, what the? Don't they change your moves? Change your other side. Well, that's cool. I think I'm gonna keep that shield, but just in case it, cha it changes, my mind's changed. I don't know what to do. One of the dexterity, one of the stamina. Hmm. Yeah. Alright. Alright, guys. I was gonna cut the video pretty soon, but I just thought I'd throw in me constructing and, you know, stuff. Repair my gear. 
I'm getting really decent money right now. I mean, I've already got 2,000 in gold. That's good money. It's mostly because me finding stuff, but still, good money. I mean, look at my stash. That's great money. I'm pretty sure more could find, more people could find more, but I'm just saying I'm lucky to have this much gold. That's my disposal. Alright everybody, I'm gonna cut the video, and we'll see you next time for the next quest. Oh wait. Visit Kane and Kara on the road encampment. Let's visit them so we can complete this quest. Kara, talk to us. You have risked your life to rescue Kane. For that we thank you. We must seek his counsel immediately. I think she gave us something. A ring? Well, thanks, but no thanks. That ring is no offense, but crud. Alrighty, guys. I'm gonna cut the video. Have a good day, and wait. Yeah! Haha, <laughs> <laughs> we beat the quest. Alright, everybody, this has been Cozy Best Mega Man. I'll see you, see you next time.